On today's episode of Adventures at Home, we have a chicken who got hurt. She ripped off one of her toenails and it's bleeding. So we're gonna have to get that taken care of. First, we're gonna wash off her foot and clean it with a little thieves dish soap. Once it's clean, we're gonna dip the toenail in some cornstarch. That will help to stop the bleeding. We are out of styptic powder, but styptic powder can be used too. If you don't have styptic powder, you can also use just regular flour. That will help it to clot off. See where the blood was coming out? It'll clot off on the end and stop bleeding. So you can keep applying it until it stops bleeding. If it's really bad, you can put a little bit of a geranium essential oil on it and that will help the bleeding to slow down and stop and then put more cornstarch on. Cayenne pepper can also be used to slow bleeding and help it clot. We got old Pepper here taken care of and her bleeding is slowing down and starting to clot up, which is a good thing. It's really important when you have chickens that if they're bleeding, you get it taken care of really quickly. We have a lot of chickens and chickens will attack each other. They are not vegetarians, despite what your egg container may say. And if chickens smell blood or taste blood, they will kill. And so they will eat another chicken completely gone um, if there's blood present. And so when we have so many chickens, it's important to make sure that at any side of blood, we take care of it very quickly so that we don't lose some of our valuable egg layers. Another reason it's really important to clean them up really quickly uh, when they are bleeding or injured is because chickens are really dirty. <laughs> Newsflash. And they can get infections in their feet. They can develop things called bumblefoot and all kinds of other issues from walking in their nasty run where they poop everywhere. And so that's another reason you wanna get it cleaned off really quickly and taken care of so that you don't have to deal with other uh, secondary infections that pop up. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe.